I'm definitely not the naturalist, most natural person on earth. Hey love buzz, it's your girl Disasters Beauty coming back with a voiceover. So this unit was sent to me by Domily Hair. Shout out to you Domily for sending me this gorgeous bob. So right here I am showing you guys what all came in the packaging as well as the bob unit. This unit does come with two combs in the front, one comb in the back with adjustable straps. And this is her. So I am going to trim this bob a little bit. Not really going to cut the hair, but I am going to trim it some. And right here, I am just kind of trying to figure out what I want to do with the parting space. And I am going to opt for doing a C type of part. And that just goes well when you're trying to cover up some of your tricks. So right here, I am cutting the hair, but you can't really see it because my mirror was in the way. I am so sorry. I didn't realize it was in the way, but I'm just trimming it a little bit to give it a little bit more shape and bounce. And I am going to be showing you guys that I'm going to tuck the hair behind my ear. It is probably the picture that you see in the thumbnail, but that is not how I'm going to be wearing my hair um, as I do the outro of this video. But I think it is a good option. It gives you that kind of 90s type of vibe. So I am going to do that and just show you guys how I achieved that look. Right here, I am going in with my grandma's hot comb, which is now my hot comb. And yeah, y'all, that is pretty much it. It's not a whole lot that I'm going to have to do to this unit, even though it may look like a lot. And yeah, if you're interested in any more details and specs and stuff about this wig, then please continue to watch. And I will see you love ups in the outro. Bye. finished out on this wig and this is what I got if you are interested in the details the specs and all that good stuff about this unit then please continue to watch okay 
Okay, y'all. So this unit was sent to me by Domily Hair. Shout out to you, Domily Hair, for sending me this unit. I hope I am pronouncing the name wrong, right. <laughs> Not wrong. I hope I am pronouncing the name right because this is my first time working with this particular company. But shout out to you guys for sending me this unit. So now we're going to get into details and specs and all that good stuff about this unit. So if you want to know all of these details, let's get into it, honey. Okay, so this unit that I am rocking right now is, uh, I'm just going to go through the list of what they have right here. So it says specifications, hair type straight, uh, cap size average, color natural black, length, it comes in 8 to 14 inches, package one piece, density 150% hair part middle part and obviously you guys see that i am not wearing this unit in a middle part y'all i hope this is not out of focus okay y'all so i hope this this is in freaking focus i feel like it's out of focus but i could be tripping but anyways y'all so obviously i am not wearing this unit in a middle part that is not the style that i was going for in my head you guys know i am th that type of person I, whatever I see in my head, I need for it to come to fruition. 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 You guys know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> but anyways, y'all. So, I did request this unit in um, 10 to 12 inches. And I requested that length because I do have a very short neck. And longer bobs just don't appear to be a bob on me. When, I, when you have a shorter neck, the longer bobs just look like... A regular everyday unit instead of a bob and you want your bobs to look like bobs so kind of know like the length of your neck like if you have like a short neck like me or you have a more elongated swan type neck like the hearts and cakes 90 okay <laughs> I always go to her because I feel like she has just like the neck of a swan like honey I'm jealous but anyways if you have a longer neck you can get a longer bob but when you have a neck that's kind of short and kind of stubby kind of like mine then you need to go for a more a shorter bob now i'm not really sure what length they sent me i did like i said request it 10 to 12 inches i didn't want anything longer than 12 inches now granted as you guys probably have saw i did cut the bob and um i did cut the bob some but that was the length that i requested and i will go into more detail about why i cut it and all that good stuff in the review portion of this video but right now we're just going to talk about the specs and details Okay, so this unit did come with, I think, two cones in the front, one cone in the back with adjustable straps. This is a frontal unit. So even though it came as a middle part, you can part it elsewhere if you want to because it is in a, a frontal. I'm trying to see if it's a 13 by 6 or 4. I honestly, I think I see, I see on here 13 by 4 and I want to guesstimate that this unit is a 13 by 4 frontal only because there was track showing when i was just trying to part it straight back and so i watched some people's videos and they kind of showed me the c part deal as you guys can kind of see i did attempt to do that i am not the best parter i always say that i am symmetrically challenged because i am honey okay i am so if i achieve this part so can you and the thing is with um 13 by 4 units instead of 13 by 6 Usually they show some track and you may still be able to see it because I ended up playing around with it a little too much. But with doing a C part, you can make it where you cover up that space that shows the, the track. And so your, your 13 by 4 parting space is not a very long part. And you want it to be long enough where it looks natural and doesn't, you know, kind of show that. So you can do like a C part and then kind of cover that space up. It makes it way more easier to cover up if you do a C part. Now, as far as um, shedding and tangling with this unit, I honestly did not notice any and I did not expect any, honey. This unit is not a long wig. And when I get wigs that are straight, <laughs> not only is she straight, she's uh, straight and short. When I get a straight, short unit, I do not expect any tangling, honey. I just don't. She does not. So, I do not expect any tangling. I do not expect any shedding. And I did not get it with this wig. So, <laughs> shout out to you, honey. Okay? Shout out to you, Domily, for, for not giving me no shedding or tangling. Okay? So, I ain't have to, you know, ship your wig back, honey. 
<laughs> so shout out to y'all okay shout out to y'all 100 so as far as the parting space i am not mad at this parting space whatsoever now if you feel like you need to open it up more you can i did not feel like the parting space was bad whatsoever now i did tweeze it a little bit like around the hairline i am just kind of like playing with tweezing trying to get better trying to perfect my crap honey because this is not my crap <laughs> But I am trying to get better at tweezing and all that to make a unit look way more natural. So I did tweeze um, like the hairline portion a little more just to give it more of a natural feel. And yeah, that is that is basically it. I did not tweeze the parting space whatsoever. So this is what the parting space comes like. And as far as the hairline, I feel like the hairline looks decent. But like I said, I did tweeze it some. So take that how you want to take it and yeah y'all that is pretty much it so as far as a lint check this is it girl okay this is it no michael jackson so if you are interested in um my review of this wig as well as the full 360 then honey please continue to watch okay honey so every time that i do a straight bob i always get nervous and i get nervous because I have always kind of struggled with straight bobs like I always see these reviews where these people make their bobs look amazing they be flat they be flowy they be as natural looking as possible now granted <laughs> I have gotten my bobs to look natural but they look Chrissy natural and I, I know you guys don't know me like you don't know you don't know Christina like from back in the day okay but it looks that kind of natural like early 2000 Christina natural where it's flat and not flowy it's just a flat unit and i wanted to have a little bit more flow so i watched somebody else's video and i saw how they were getting the flow where it didn't kind of fall flat at the ends which was always my issue my issue was that my units were kind of falling flat at the ends so it would look decent um you know in pictures and it would look decent video wise but as far as the longevity of them like not not really the longevity longevity of that day <laughs> if that makes sense it would kind of just fall kind of flat and i want to kind of flow so what when i went to watching all these straight bob videos what i noticed is everybody was cutting them okay like everybody was cutting their bob so i was like okay okay honey okay i see you girl i see you you need to cut some hair so i cut some hair on my bob and honestly it did help it helped it lay a little bit better what also helped with to lay my bob and make it look a little more natural like today's sort of natural was using the hot comb and styling it on my mannequin head honey it, it really changed the game up for your girl okay <laughs> so i did do that and to me like it just gave it a more natural feel like even tucking it behind my ear i just feel like it has a more natural feel to it like, i am feeling it and i am feeling my little c part like i didn't think i was gonna get it down but i feel like i did a decent job like i feel like i did a decent job on this wig in general so yeah let me know what you guys think are you feeling it like i'm feeling it do you think she's a look do you think she's cute yeah let me know down below in the comments if you like her and yeah y'all that is pretty much it now i am finally going to give you guys a full 360 and we can wrap this thing all the way up. okay so this is obviously the unit in the front this is it on the left side this is it in the back on the right side okay so let me know what you guys think let me know if you like it do you like this bob do you like straight bobs do you struggle with straight bobs like i do let me know down below in the comments and yeah y'all that's pretty much it oh and once again if you are interested in this unit all the information as well as the direct link to this wig will be listed down below in the description box description box for your convenience and yeah y'all okay I'm so if you like this video give me a thumbs up if you have any questions something you feel like i may have left out feel free to comment down below and if you're not already subscribed sis click the subscribe button and if you're not ready to follow me on all my social media platforms i am disastrous beauty on both ig and facebook i'm held to miss c on snapchat and i'm disastrous b 
on Twitter. And I will see you love books next time. Bye.